Hey guys, welcome to danperetta.com. I'm your host, of course, Dan Peretta. Today, like any good filmmaker in the industry today, I'm going to digitally remaster, repackage, reshoot, redo, same thing I've done before, which is a t-shirt folding machine with upgrades and enhancements. Uh, this time it's gonna be shot in high def and hopefully more enjoyable for your viewing pleasure. Sit back, and get ready to be blown away. thing you need to do is figure out what your shelf size is and how big you want the t-shirt to be when it's folded. For me, I have a 24 inch shelf, but 24 inch wide shelf, and I want two stacks of shirts. Now, though the, shirt, the shelf is 24 inches, I can only really use about 22 inches. So if I were to divide that in half, that would be 11 inch, 11 inch wide shirt. Um, I want a little bit more room between the shirts and to get things in and out. Um, so I'm going to decide on a 20 or a, a 10 inch shirt. So I'm going to decide on a 10 inch wide shirt. All right, let's lay out this the panels that we're going to need out of the foam core. You're going to need three panels, and based on the size that I want. Um, Essentially, each panel will be 10 inches wide. Uh, so each one will be 10, 10, and 10. Was 10 inches wide and then I want it to be 12 inches long and that's what I'm doing here I'm cutting the main center panel um, to 12 inches so it'll be 10 by 12 
the wings, uh, panels B and C, to be able to kind of fold up uh, behind the panel so I can eventually fold it so you can fold it even smaller. Um, to do that I gotta take the wings off and retape them. I put them um, basically in the position I want them in and tape them in the position and then they'll lay flat. Then fold them over um, and then tape. Basically you're taping both sides of the joints. This makes the joints a little bit larger but uh, will allow the flexibility to fold the wing um, either uh, either way on top or on back and uh, as you'll see later on this makes it so we can fold it up really small So for travel mode, um, essentially going to flip these up underneath, flip this like this, leave this tag out, um, this one can fold this way, and this one can fold this way, and uh, you have a pretty tight little package. Um, this stores easily. You can easily remove this, not need that if you don't want to. It's easily stores and uh, easily transport. Well guys, that about wraps it up for this t-shirt folding machine. I hope you like the upgrades that I incorporated and the travel options that you have here. Um, if this video was at all helpful, interesting, halfway entertaining, um, please subscribe. I have some great videos coming out, uh, DIY lights, um, some RC car and RC plane stuff and uh, business and website stuff that I'm working on. Uh, like it, share, watch my other videos, check out the blog. I appreciate it and keep yourself tuned in to danferetta.com. Once again, I'm your host, Dan Fretta. Have a great day.